homicide detectives. The clock starts ticking the moment they are called. Witnesses picked you out and described you and say you were the last one she watched while she died laughing. I didn't have my daughter laughing. That couldn't be me. We have too much evidence. We just need a confession. <gasps> Man, Mr. Sir, I swear to God, I ain't mean to kill that girl. I ain't mean to have her die laughing. I can give her a cup of water. I'm gonna need a cigarette too. You did a good thing by me. And I wish the best for you. Yeah, we'll take my picture right quick. Bitch, I am not your personal fucking photographer. Just take the picture and just snap yeah. a few of them. Then you look stupid. Give me my phone. Hmm. Ugh, bitch, all these pictures are ugly. Bitch, it ain't the picture. I'll just take a selfie. Bitch, I'm outside. Come on. Sharita, bitch, I called you 30 minutes ago and told you to be ready. I had to take a shower and iron my clothes. Girl, the fucking club is only free till 11. Bitch, it's already 9.48. You know they gonna hold a motherfucking line. I'm gonna call Daryl. He gonna let us in. Bitch, Daryl is not gonna answer his fucking phone. You know that. He never do. He might. Bitch, I'm about to leave you. Fuck you. Bitch, wait for me. Well, you gonna be paying both our motherfucking way because I been told you, bitch. I'm not paying 20. Fucking fatty, fucking boy, excuse my fucking father. He ain't got a fucking job, bitch. He ain't buy my fucking baby a pair of fucking white, bitch. He ain't got two fucking quarters to rub together. But guess what, bitch? Me and my baby gonna be fine. We gonna do our fucking thing without him. Fuck you. Pathetic ass niggas. My name is Janae. I'm 13 years old. I was put out of school for fighting. I got expelled. Um. Some usually say that I'm they say that I'm bad, but I'm not really bad. I'm more like I, I guess you could say I'm destructive, but I'm not really bad. I got put out of school because I was fighting. I uh, punched this girl in her face. And I broke her nose, but it wasn't really my fault. I just I was just sitting in the back of the class eating my hot chips and my pickle, but she was messing with me, so I just got up and punched her. But the principal expelled me and didn't touch her, so at school. See, Janae is not your average teenager. She she does things that you wouldn't you see your ordinary 13 year old doing. She drinks alcohol. She smokes on my cigarettes. She stole them out of my purse. She steals my keys out the purse. She drives up down the street. Then they has to be stopped. I I have no no way of disciplining Janae no more. He, if Janae keep going down this path, Janae either gonna wind up dead or in prison. That's all I can say about it. My mom abandoned me when I was four years old, and my grandmother picked me up. It really hurt to know that your mama just don't care about you and just abandon you like you're a piece of trash. Janae's mama left her a long, long time ago and I had to pick her up. So I felt like that was my job, to take her under my wing. But even Red Bull can't give me a wing big enough to keep her under. She is out of control. I feel like that's probably why I'm so mad because it's the stuff that my parents done in the past that made me this way. I don't know what I'm living for. I'm, I'm just here so I don't get fined. Is Janae a fighter? You asking me that is equivalent to somebody asking a uh, men still getting in prison. Let's just put it like this. If this Janae was Ray Rice's wife, Janae, it would have been the other way around. This Janae would have been dragging Ray Rice on out of there. This is where I practice how to fight. As you can see, I cracked her skull. I punched her so hard, but I had to put tape right here. But I, I use her as a punching dummy, and that's how I, I fight. One thing though, those, those prisoners better not get in my face, so I'm, I'm gonna have to punch them in theirs. And I punch real hard, cause I fight hard. Look, look at my knuckles. I punch real hard with those, so they better stay out my face. Honestly, I don't believe I'ma change, because it's just the show, them people in jail, they not gonna be able to touch me, so them too. My name is Officer Warline. I've been in the police force for 30 odd years. I've worked with battered children from ages five on up for about 11 years now. 
Hey, hey, Teve, come here. Come on, Stay your ass out the streets, huh? Staying out of trouble? Yep, Mr. Warline, you know. I feel like sometimes I relate best to these kids. I grew up in the Melphamine Project. All right, don't let your mama give me no call now. Didn't have a mom. Grew up with my father the majority of the time. He left me when I was 12. So I can really relate to most of their stories. You don't have to go down this road. You can be whatever you want. And I chose to be a police officer and not look at me. Janae's gonna be a tough cookie. That cookie will get broken and dipped in milk. Believe that. I had some free time to watch the footage on uh, Miss Janae. Just to show them you in jail, they not gonna be able to touch me, so. This this a damn shame. I gotta be honest. She's she's gonna be a handful. But I'm uh I'm meeting with her grandmother now. We're gonna go over some stuff. I wanna let her know that you know a, a regular jail visit for Janae wouldn't do much. So we got a game plan and try something different. So I'm looking for the house now. Uh, that must be her right there. I'm gonna try to put something together and uh get Janae scared straight. When I first seen Officer Walmart, my first thought was. Is that cooch here glued on his motherfucking face? As I entered the house, my first thoughts was it's a beautiful, well-kept house. My mom seems like she's very wonderful, sweet. Looked like she wouldn't hurt a fly, let alone try to hurt somebody's feelings. He got parasites, lice all in that. I see it all. <laughs> so me and my mom sat down, discussed everything, went into detail. She seemed like she really liked my idea, and uh, I think we're ready to move forward. Officer Walmart did all the talking. I was just basically listening, well, half listening, because I was still distracted by the thing on his face. I'm looking for ticks and shit in there, because I know something living in there. Everything was going pretty smooth, and then next thing you know, my mom, I thought I smelled bacon in here. Mama, I'm not cooking breakfast, baby. You hungry? Oh, you was referring to him as a pig. Let me run this to you like a five-mile marathon. Why the f is Officer Walgreens in my house, though? I see you looking, but what's cooking? Chicken or beef? I honestly never met somebody as rude and disrespectful as Janine. Oh, but trust me, we gonna fix her. Fix her like a bowl of cereal. Yeah, I'm pissed off. I'm pissed off to the 10th power. Because what the f he doing in my motherfucking house? I don't f with him like that and he and this f running his f mouth like my grandma f with him. We get pest control all the time, so ain't no rats here. But I don't know what the f he coming over here from. But I'm gonna let you know one thing, I don't f with him and he not gonna f with me. So my plan was, we not gonna bring Janae to prison. We gonna bring the prison to Janae. Got a call today from Janae's grandmother. I done had it up the hill with Janae. She gotta go. I don't give a damn what she goes. This girl is out here using my good vacuum, vacuuming up rocks and grass like it's a goddamn lawnmower. She, she can get on out of here. Whatever, whatever Dr. Walmart got her set up, he gonna do it. Officer, doctor, I don't care. I tried to get some court orders to let me get a few prisoners to carry in there, but uh, the judge turned it down. Said it's a endangerment to the environment and myself as well, so I had to go to plan B. They never said I couldn't use a previous prisoner though. Oh yeah, we gonna bring it to our ass. Believe that. I chose somebody I dealt with uh, a few months ago. Her name was Shush. This going on real TV or is like some YouTube stuff y'all working on? She had to be one of the worst people I've ever arrested. All right, that'll funk your bitch. Ain't tell telling me it was gonna be on TV, but, but am I even allowed to curse on this sh Oh yeah. Yo. Y'all sense everything out? Oh, how about that? <laughs> my the <laughs> and she's not even a real criminal, but in my eyes, that's a murder. So I'm just chilling, minding my own business, and I get this phone call from Officer Walline. He's telling me he needs to scare somebody straight. So I'm like, so why you calling me? I only did 30 days in that thing. I ain't even really, you know, yeah, what they had with it. The judge ordered her to do 90 days in jail because. Late tickets she didn't pay. I had attachments at the time. I seen the judge and the judge told me either pay $600 or spend 90 days in jail. Bitch, I took the 90 days so fast I had just bought some badass heels that weekend, bitch, and they was not about to go back, so fuck that. I'm not about to pay 600 either, though. I'll take these little days, I ain't tripping. I believe she did about 30 of those days before they let her go on good behavior. Her behavior wasn't even good, they just ain't want to deal with her no more. They needed her out the system. So I cut up so bad, bitch, they let me go in 30. Hmm. They know what's up. I ran the idea to shush about Janae. I gave her some information on it and let her see Gotta the footage. Oh Lord, this girl cuts up, no scissors. How old y'all say she is? 13, 13 plus what? 
This is a grown ass woman. That is my girl. I love her. Right now, Janae believes this is gonna be just a regular episode of Beyond Scared Straight. She don't even know what's about to hit her. We're gonna see how brave Janae is when she locked in a room with a real prisoner for three hours. Today is the day I'm supposed to meet with Janae. Um, they got me in this little jumpsuit. They could've hit this with an iron or something, cause this little wrinkle. So the plan is for me to be in a room locked up with him and I'm gonna have to have handcuffs on. But I swear for God, if this girl hit me while I got these fucking handcuffs on, girl, I'm going to real jail because I'm going to beat the f out of that girl. I don't give a f if she's 13. I don't give a f if she's 6. But she's going to get punched back down. The day has finally come for Janae to meet Shush. And we're going to see if Janae can handle a real present. Girl, I went in there with it on my mind, yeah. I wasn't about to let this little girl play with me. The wonder of the world is gone. So, what, what person is that? Janae, you will be locked in a room with this prisoner here for about two hours. You a motherfucking liar. I ain't about to go up in there with that, that thing. I show you a motherfucking thing. I ain't no thing. You can read, bitch. My name is Shush. You ain't drop out, dumbass, bitch. You got expelled. Now keep fucking playing me, bitch. I break these fucking cuffs off and break your fucking neck. <laughs> I just went in that bitch to go in hell, girl. I just, I just swore when I was a prisoner, bitch. I felt like one from the heart. They were supposed to go to the jail. I'm not being locked up in no room with no damn murderer. You better play the lottery today, bitch, because it's your lucky day, because I ain't no murderer. Yet. Oh, I sworn you said it wasn't no jail visit gonna scare you. I don't care, that, that's against the law, I can't. I didn't know what the fuck I was talking about, but I was gonna make that make sense some kind of way. <laughs> Officer Walline, you better get this crazy bitch out of here. See how she called me crazy? I'll kill you. Get up, I'm not playing, get her. Scary bitch. In order for you to understand prison, Janae, you gotta be locked in a room with a prisoner. Y'all can't make me go in a room with her against my will. Grandma, tell him, please. I'm not going in the room with them. Tell him. Ain't no grandma, tell him that. You, you brought this to find, you brought this to find yourself. I don't feel sorry for you. Why would I? You treat me like trash. In all my years of dealing with Janae, I've never seen her this scared before. So I'm actually enjoying the show that uh, Shush is putting on for us because. It, it kind of reminds me of that little show on Netflix. What is it? Black is the same color, orange, something, something like that. But that, 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 that's what it kind, that's what it kind of remind me of, and I'm happy to see it. You treat everybody around you who trying to help you like shit. So now I feel like you need to find out what it really feel like to sit up in prison. So I think you should go on, on back there and get in there. I can't wait to get you in that room. I swear to God, I'm gonna stretch your to like my last twenty dollars on a Monday, and I don't get paid till Friday. No, that guy fucking stretch like. It's lockdown time, Janae. I need you to stand on up and come walk with us towards the back room, please. Woo! Let's go! Come on, baby, let's go. Let's get it in. Let's do this now. Come on, scary. Let's go. Officer Walla, I'm not going in there. You can forget about that. I'm not going in there with no fucking criminal. This is not about to happen. It ain't the time to try to discuss it now, Janae. We gotta go. Come on, let's go. You can't make me do nothing I don't want to do. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. It's not up for discussion. Let's Bro, go now. I'm not wrong for that, too. Because I'm your little kidney. You trying to put me in there with a fucking tiger. Mama ain't got no pets. Don't, don't even call on me. You ain't no damn cat anyway. Let you talk about a bow cat. I don't care. I'm not. La 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 la, I'm not going, I'm not going, I'm not going. Hey, you was going in that room. Let's go. Don't grab my arm, I'm not going. Don't stop, grandma, stop grabbing. Get up. Move. Back up. Give us a room. Back up. Back up. Cold 40, Mama, get up. Ugly lady down. Mama, Mama, please get up. Get up, Mama. Mama, please get up.
Oh, oh, get up! You gotta breathe. Come on, breathe, 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 breathe. Keep breathing. Come on, come on. Come on. It's difficult. Come on, stay with me now. Stay with me, Momo. Come on. Do something. Come on, Momo. You gotta breathe. Breathe with me. Come on. What is taking this bitch so long? I've been told this sort of come the fuck on. That was gonna get killed out there, and I'm gonna be fucking laughing at it because I've been told a stupid ass to be here. These fuck boys would try to play with me like that. They purge on me and try to ride me, bitch, please. But bitch, I've been out here. The purge don't fucking scare me at all. Man, oh, bitch, don't shoot you right in your fucking head. Ain't no bad up, bitch. They been to me. Man, right, hold up. That sound like them right there. Yep, that is them. Who is it? Open the door, bitch. Who you think? I don't know, bitch. Maybe purges? You forgot? Fuck. I see you can count money, bitch, but you can't tell time. Play with your pussy, ho. Don't play with me. Told you about that. Girl down. Whoa. Hey. Took y'all hoes long enough, bitch. I thought y'all was about to go out there and murk some fucking people. Cash taking up precious time, man. I'm in the fucking car spooking, man. I, mean, I don't think we're gonna get out here blowing the fuck off. Girl, I swear, if I wasn't a woman and I ain't have a vagina, I, I swear to God, that's how a pussy look right there. Bitch, he is pussy. Shit, I don't blame him. Them people about to go dumb out there. My partner was talking about hitting a nigga in the head with a shotgun. Bow, I told that boy, don't come to 5981 Ohio with that. Boy, I almost called you out your name. Bitch. I know you did not tell this boy the address. Yeah, I did. Y'all think he gonna come? Oh, my Lord. Jesus, please give me the strength, because I'm gonna fucking kill this boy during this purge. CB, please make sure that door locked over there. Boston, you really a dumbass, dog. But good thing we got 20 minutes before the purge starts. Girl, I ain't got time for this shit. Who is that? Answer. Man, you answer that. This ain't my house. Tried to tell you, that's a pussy punk bitch. Move, get out the way. Out there. Oh, oh, everybody, everybody make a sound. Everybody, oh, hey, everybody, hey, hey. get on God, the ground. Got about twenty racks on right now, dog. You can hit her up. I ain't got shit, man. I ain't worth it. Good thing it's just that bitch Patricia, cause I'd be dead as fuck up in here. Hey, see, see. But how did you know it was me? Um, bitch, cause maybe you walking down the street looking like pest control, but you got fucking wings on your back. Bitch, exterminate yourself for me right quick. You, my friend, are aggravating like a rash, and that's why I keep plastic, because I can't stand cash. <laughs> I love my bitch, Po Cash. She got you, huh? She ain't got cash, bitch. That's why you call her Po. <laughs> po, bitch, what are you doing out there? I know you ain't purging, bitch. Girl, I bought this gun to see what it's about, and tonight is the purge, so I'ma test it out. Y'all not purging? Fuck no, not me, ho, but I did put prices on people's head, bitch. I'm getting some people whacked tonight. Bitch, why you ain't tell me? I could have put money on Mr. Smith head, bitch. You remember the social study teacher that failed us, bitch? Bitch, you ain't got no money. Well, bitch, we could have went half, you know me. Man, I don't know how y'all can deal with seeing all that blood and shit, man. I can't do it. You should be used to that. You a walking minstrel, pussy boy. Man, call me what you want. I know one thing. I ain't got no STD, but I play it safe. Wait, wait, shh, shh. They about to talk about it. They about to talk about the purse. Turn it up, Austin. Turn it up.
Yeah. We're just a minute away from the official purge of 2014. We ask that if you're not participating in the cleanse of the purge, to please stay inside, lock up, and try to stay as safe as possible. Thank you. Say, homie, y'all gotta get me the fuck out of here. Reminder, the annual purge has commenced. For the next 12 hours, all crime is legal. That's my call, so I guess I'm gonna see y'all. Later, come out the door. All right, girl, stay safe, like with money in it with a combination lock. Man, I don't know about y'all, but like I'm nervous as fuck. My heart really beating fast. Like I had a bad feeling about this one. Just have faith, my boss, baby. I think we're gonna be all right. Just have faith, y'all. You're right, shush. We gotta keep faith. Come on, y'all. Bow y'all heads. Let's pray. Our Father, Our Father, who was in heaven, who, was in heaven, who, made, it rain, who made it rain, at huh? King of Diamonds, cash can't be seen. and made it uh -uh, cash. Ain't nobody about to play with you with this prayer. Who are you talking to? Who you think, girl? God. Girl, what guy? Your trap guy? No, clown, the Lord. Must be talking to your landlord or your drug lord because I don't talk to my lord like that. Is you crazy? Well, baby, guess what? That's how me and mine talk. Well, whatever floats your boat. Correction, not a boat, a yacht. Well, yacht. Whatever. What was that? Oh my god. Cash, you're not going like this. What? Watch out. Oh, the right one. Who? What is it? Oh my god. Girl, I'm not about to play with these people. Them bitches play with my motherfucking car. Wait, Wait, Cash, what are you doing? Hey, Cash, man, chill out, chill out. Them motherfuckers. It's my motherfucking car. Motherfucker. Cash friend, just, just come inside. You can buy another one, it's not worth it. Come inside. My partner on the West Bank will fix that for the low. Not like you need cheap or nothing, but come on, please. You think you can do this to me? You motherfuckers will be playing basketball in Pelican Bay when I get finished um, with you. Cash L. Washington, you done? Get your ass inside. Bitch, I'm just so fucking mad. <laughs>